नमस्कार आई एम अखिल श्रीवास्तव एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन द डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग ऑफ इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजी डिपार्टमेंट इन दिस वेदर ब्रीफिंग वी विल सी हाउ वाज द वेदर डूइंग पास्ट 24 फोर आवर्स एंड वॉट वी एक्सपेक्ट इन टर्म्स ऑफ वेदर इन द कमिंग नेक्स्ट वन वीक इफ वी सी द मेन वेदर विच इज ऑब्रूड इन पास्ट ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स दट इज एट एट थर्टी आवर्स आई एस टी ऑफ टूडे थर्टी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑगस्ट दैन यू कैन सी दट इन दिस मैप वेर एवर यू आर सींग दी ऑरेंज कलर very heavy rainfall has been reported in past 24 hours ending at 8:30 hours ist of today the yellow regions are showing the areas where heavy rainfall has been reported and green areas with the symbols are showing the regions where light to moderate rainfall activity has been reported so if we'll see then you can see in the tamil nadu area orange color is showing that very heavy rainfall has been reported and if you see the values then in sivaganga 14 cm rainfall has been reported in vilupuram 12 cm and 11 cm rainfall has been reported if you talk about sarmal west bengal that you can see the yellow color then in jalong 10 cm rainfall For health has been reported, and in Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, uh, sorry, Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, and Tripura uh, subdivision, nine centimeter rainfall has been reported in Gomati district. If we talk about Assam and Meghalaya, then in Kutcha district, seven centimeter rainfall has been reported. So this is uh, that means most of the rainfall activity has been confined to the northeastern parts and in the extreme southern parts. If we talk about the significant rainfall activity, if we see the highlights for the next week, then we are expecting that there will be increase in the rainfall activity over eastern parts of the country and adjoining central India. From 2nd of September, also isolated heavy rainfall activity is likely to continue over uh, Nagaland, Mizoram, Mizoram and Tripura, and the Man Nicobar Islands during the next five days. And we are expecting that heavy rainfall likely to occur in the extreme south and central India during next three days. Also, over the rest parts of the country, our expectation is that there will be subdued rainfall activity during next five days. If we talk about the different synoptic systems which are impacting India today, then you can uh, see with the help of the satellite imagery, uh, the monsoon trough is still persisting along the foothills of the Himalayas. There is a cyclonic circulation over East UP and adjoining Bihar region. Also, there is a cyclonic circulation over uh, eastern parts of the Bangladesh and a cyclonic circulation over Northeast Bay of Bengal. There is also a cyclonic circulation over West Central Bay of Bengal of Andhra Pradesh coast. If we talk about the main weather warnings for the next five days, then you can see with the help of this map the uh, different regions where green color is shown. That is showing the areas where light to moderate rainfall uh, is expected at a few places, uh, isolated to few places. You can see in most of these five days map which is shown over here, most of the areas are we are not expecting any heavy or very heavy rainfall activity. If we talk about the northeastern parts of the country, then you can see for the next three to five days you are seeing uh, heavy rainfall warning has been issued for Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, and Tripura. If we talk about the southern part, extreme southern part, then Tamil Nadu very heavy rainfall is issued for today. That is the orange warning. And in the Kerala, Andaman Nicobar for today, yellow warning, heavy rainfall at isolated places has been issued. If we see the other days also, for next three days in the extreme south and western India, we are expecting heavy rainfall to occur at Tamil Nadu uh, region in particular. If we talk about the eastern parts of the country, then you can say from day three, the eastern parts will receive uh, enhanced rainfall activity. That means rainfall activity will increase over eastern parts and. at joining central parts of the country so you can see that the rainfall uh, warning has been issued for odisha on day 3 then odisha and chatisgarh day 4 gwb on day 4 and odisha chatisgarh vidarbha and cap regions on day 4 that is yellow warning is expect uh, is been issued as we are expecting heavy rainfall over these regions starting from day 3 that is from the 2nd of september under these warning situation we are expecting some localized flooding event may happen uh, and also there may be some disruption in the traffic and your traffic time will be elongated or it will be more so take accordingly take uh, necessary precautions while planning your traffic these are the information for today for uh, similar kind of information we will again meet tomorrow till then have a good time namaskar